What's up guys? This is amazing. So uh, this is a huge sycamore, probably around 200 years old. And an indicative thing about bigger sycamores is that a lot of times they do have these huge cavities. There's a lot of accounts in history of early settler times of when people would literally, in much larger sycamore trees, use these as shelters because they would be triple this size before everything was clear cut. And natives use this kind of stuff too, but today animals would use this. I mean, I could see coyote being in here. I could see if it was in an area where there was bear, bear would definitely take shelter, but this is gorgeous. I would go to sleep in here if I could. It's beautiful. I love this time of year when you get that push and pull of winter. Um, we are entering the slowest time of the year, the Yule season, and things are very still. But at the same time, when you get really warm days today, when it's like 54 degrees, for a second you start to think that it's spring because the sun comes out and it's that really weird vibe that it feels like it's February and things are awakening again, but at the same time, it's the shortest time of the year, slowest time of the year. Winter will eventually set in, but I'm gonna enjoy the warm while I can in the just pristine, cold water. Just tripled our <laughs> saddle manners, yeah. <laughs> Beautiful little two line. Well, it took nice you forever dusky. to find a dusky. Years. And now you realize where to find them at. That's insane, yeah. You just yeah. probably just look in the wrong area because we found them all the time now. I'm sorry, buddy. There's the dusky. So I stopped to film the uh, 
um, tornado sirens or whatever those were. And look at this, as found. There is no meat on it. It's a little bit. There's just like roots and stuff. But that is insane. Look at that. Is Whoa, that is beautiful. It's so nice sometimes, especially when it's a little windy or when you can see different patterns in the clouds just to lay on the forest floor. Uh, Peely a woodpecker, but to lay on the forest floor and just watch the branches move and the wind cut through. And just listen. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm just relaxing in the middle of a valley as the cold front comes through. We found some beautiful salamanders. Just got to enjoy the forest. Cold setting in. If it wasn't for the location I'm at right now and the fact I don't have a fire or anything like that, I would literally just fall asleep here randomly. But, hopefully you enjoyed the essence of nature videos that I keep doing. I plan on doing more in the future. I plan on also doing like random derpy ones too, but we'll see what happens. And he's over here. Um, he can come back behind the camera randomly. Um, yeah. Um, but you can give credit to him for finding all the salamanders today because I flipped a hundred rocks and didn't find a single salamander. Besides the like red back that I found under the leaves, but he found dusky, dusky, uh, and several two lines. two lines. I think like four. I think he found like four two lines and a red back, which yeah, something like that. He has really good luck when it comes to salamanders. I have good luck when it comes to snakes usually, but he has the salamander, so thankful to have his good sensing around to find the good spots. I had a great time just being out in the woods. It's a perfect day. Uh, got a little warm going up and down the hills but then the temperature is just perfect and hardly had to rest for the old man at all yeah so we covered a lot of ground saw a lot of things and had a great time hope you guys enjoyed i will catch you guys in the next event you Woo! Okay. well now comes the fun part of crossing the creek on our way back first thing i'm doing is testing how deep and sinky it is Wow. It's like a foot right there. It's only like two feet deep right here. All right, guys. I'm derpily in my skippies. Okay, okay, this. It looks pretty firm. That's firm. Woo, feet are getting cold.